Snazzy. And today is a little bit of an experiment. Old realm that we don't really use anymore. Just gonna check out the old build that we have here. Pretty big. This is the basement. I have all of the sheep over here. Every color of wool. I would like to try to make this into an auto shearing sheep farm. So I can have all the wool that I want without having to you know, really work on getting it. Like it's a pain in the butt. This is the chess room. It's a tad bit laggy in here because of all of the stuff I have. Got some of my other farm here, my own sugarcane farm. There's nothing in it. That goes to my zombie spawn kill chamber. This is where I used to have villagers, and then I moved them to the other side. Over here. It's not a very pretty place. Yeah, I had to put a ladder so these guys wouldn't be sneaking out on me. I used them to get the, uh, the achievement of trading for a thousand emeralds. You know, almost one set of every type of armor. Got my mushroom. And, yeah. So I'm not entirely sure what I have planned for the next few episodes. Because a lot of my... A lot of the realms or worlds that I'm in, they are all uh, partial. They're not fresh starting, unfortunately. So you can see all of my farms, and I mined this all out myself. I had taken my beacon down, which was actually... It was over there. That's why there's like a random glass... Random chunk of glass in the ground right here. It goes all the way down to bedrock. Yeah, my previous video, that's what all of my- most of my clips are from this. Like, this is where the zombie... He was bouncing on my, uh... My bubble elevator that goes downstairs. <laughs> and there's my area. I have all of this. All of that. And then there's a little... I call my little vacation home fishing hut. And the path goes down through the mountain here to the main village, the end village. And then this goes to my friend Funyan's house. And this is all supposed to be the farming area. Oh yeah, that's right. I have sheep out there now. Is it nighttime? Look. Nope, not yet. Let's go check it out. Alright, uh, this is the kitchen area. I built everything myself. Got lots of beehives out here. Full of honey. So, I have lots of honey and I've quite the collection of discs so far. Just going through. I've got, I got the pet or the cat achievement. Plethora of cats. And they're still, they're just everywhere. They're all over my, uh, my place. And I got a bird here. Collect, pet collector. That should be a thing. I have one of every type of pet. The side where I've got my horses over here. And that's a, a spare bedroom in the basement. For all my sheeps. Now this was for my store. Let me eat first. Okay. Maybe I'll will collect. Oh, my shears are missing. Sorry, bees. 
It's like someone stole my hives. <laughs> Let's see. I'm trying to think of what I should do. You know, maybe if someone were to leave a suggestion in the comments on what I should do next. I've done so much on this world. You know, starting a new world is an option. There's many of my other worlds that are semi-started. But this is quite finished. I mean, I still have like this project that I never finished here. It's kind of a... Uh, Random. Is that a horse? Is there a horse in this house? How did you get in here? So random. Okay. What else? Oh, no, no. I heard a pillager. Maybe he's underground. Oh, there's more than one pillager. This is where I, I had those pigs. This, wait, right here. This is the spot. I had them here. I had them all penned up here. And a pillager walked past. And I tried to shoot it with my bow. And I straight up missed and hit the cat that was sitting over there. When I got all those cats from the, the plethora of cats, uh, cat's achievement I had uh, set them all over my area so that they were like my creeper prevention because creepers are afraid of, of cats so like you see I've got one here some of them have names some of them don't I think all of the cats I have in the house are the ones that are named and the ones that are outside there should be one hidden in the flowers or no, wait. You moved. You moved. Okay. So I figure maybe I'll do some a little bit of exploring for now. Just checking out the remnants of the realm. What's left over. But there's not much. Not much more to do anymore. Just my little lounge area here. We got a little bar. I would like a drink, please. I have barrels. They're just potions. Water. They're just water bottles, that's all. And my secret escape. Maybe I shouldn't shut that gate. I've had too many things come and sit in my couch because. Let's see, are they all over here? No, I had them. Yeah, this is what all the sheep are for. My store. <laughs> all this wool to make banners. Yep, and I think, I think one of the... No, maybe I left it at the, the shop. So we'll take a quick run over there to go see if that's where I left it, my shulker box. Not in my inventory. No. My inventory is pretty much empty. Okay. So let's let's run off. We're running into the distance. It's not too far away. This is the vil the end village that Jeep and I formerly known as Jeep, <laughs> have been working on for all ever. It has changed so many times. Actually, let me see if it's still here. Yeah, this over here is where you might recognize wishing well or this thing. This is where I saw those villagers and that they walked in that straight line. I I can't believe that they did that. Oh, I thought I had beds over here. Oh, that's hilarious. Do I have that effect on me right now? It's giving me like night vision. That's from the conduit. 
we had gotten the conduit. It should be in the water over here. Yeah, this is a coral reef that we had planned on building up and it, it never really panned out. This is where all those dolphins had spawned in. They were, that was legit natural, legit natural dolphin spawning in. Not a joke. Because this is a full on survival world. Mm. No cheats, nothing, nothing fancy, no creative. Now let's see, where did Jeep move the portal? There he Move the portal over here. <coughs> we'll use the portal. Oh. Let's go to Welbra. That scared me. Okay. Which way? There it is. Here's the hallway. Quick jog through the nether. Yes, Miss Funyan has built up this very nicely. She uh, did amazing job. She did quite amazing. And you can see here some of her shulker boxes left out. Okay, this is the portal that goes to the spawn. to go explore. This is spawn point. That's Chief made that. That's who's messaging me trying to get me to join his party. Yeah. Take a little quick soar. Down and through the spawn area. A lot of things are still in the works of being built. Now, like in this realm, we base our colors for people. So, like I'm magenta. This is these are my shulker boxes, and I should have. A, there's my horse. All right, let me go get my horse. There he is. Cool. trip over to my shop. I highly doubt I've sold anything. I don't even know when the last time someone was on. I need to adjust. I need to adjust my recording times. All of my floor is gone? What happened? Why did all of my floor disappear? All of my signs are down? See, I had chips for tips. <laughs> of flesh and I had golden apples one yeah. banner for quartz ooh somebody did buy it one okay glowstone and then it was empty but I'm sad what happened to my floor that's insane oh, that's right okay and I put all of those um that's my shop right there. It was cute until the floor got ruined. I don't know what that's about. There's other shops here, like the hive. They just we sell honey. Three 
emeralds for one block of honey. 30 emeralds for one honeycomb block and 10 emeralds for one honeycomb. Looks like someone took a bite out of it. <laughs> 15 emeralds for one uh, honey bottle. Closed. Oh well, he's closed. Sold out. About the slime shop. Looks like a big slime. Alright. One diamond per five slime balls. One diamond. Okay. I think it's a good thing I, I don't need any slime balls right now. And then there's so many other spots that have not gotten, uh, no one's using them. Again, me, building. <laughs> I have chests everywhere. So they're divided up into little plots so that anyone can have a shop somewhere. And in the world, everyone got real busy and stopped playing on this all together. But we'll see. Oh. Maybe we'll go check out the church slash cathedral. So there's a I've built quite a lot on this on this realm. And if that's you know something you would prefer me to do, like what kind of things do you wanna see? Cause I know I like watching all different kinds of stuff. Honestly. I like watching people build, I like watching people explore. Is there a preference? Or do you feel the same way? You like a hodgepodge of stuff? Like, would you prefer me to build this kind of thing again? Not the same thing, obviously. It's got a little podium. Pretty skylight. Even has a, ooh. Even has the creepy basement. This is not so creepy. It's a little creepy. And then there's a, there's a lot. There's quite a lot in this realm. It's really large, and that's one thing that I think made a lot of people stop playing. Is there's just so much. Where do you think you're going? Where? Take this scenic route. So this way, this is the port. It's really cool looking. I think there's too much lumber laying around. <laughs> too many shipments of lumber. Ooh, does this work? Oh no, they're out of fire charges. Any fire charges in this one? Oh no, isn't there one more? There's one more. Let's see. Cross your fingers. Yeah! There it goes! <laughs> oh, there's a little fox! Hey, dude! Sheep and horses. It's a cute area. And this is the windmill that I built. Over here. Built the barn for the hay. Built this weird looking bridge. I don't really like it. I mean, I built it, and I kind of like it, but I kind of don't. I like building these kinds of things. So. We'll go down here. The back way. Real narrow. I don't want to break anything past. Out to here. Which is the other thing I built. Like, I've built so much. Like, this is supposed to be... It's supposed to be kind of like... Oh, I, look, there's the horse tie-up. I put him on the wrong thing. Oh, well. 
this is like um I guess a brothel kind of thing where you get like the bar here where you can get some food and then there's supposed to be rooms upstairs to stay in but it, it never got fully finished there's a lot of things that never got a hundred percent finish in this realm and that's what I want to be able to to have a realm that we stick to oh the bridge is gorgeous but I did make all these little tiny houses in here. And these are all like starter homes for new people who join in. Which I think if there were, if people actually wanted to join in and play in this, Funyun would be tickled pink. So leave a comment for me if, if, if opening this to the community for people to survive in, if people would be interested in that, like joining to play, that's definitely something you should leave a comment in. It's one of the bigger houses. It's got a little st it starts you off. You know, there's an anvil, potion, the brewing stand, there's the enchantment area. With, I mean, there's no table, and it's not fully powered, but it's still better than nothing. There's a bed. Cute little starting area. Oh, up there is supposed to be the massive castle that we've been putting off forever. Got the layout started. That's about it. <laughs> so let's see. Oh, it's about to be dark again. Let's get the horse. You. sleep at the shop tonight. Mm -mm -mm. No, you're not going anywhere. Stay here. Let's pass the night away. I really should. I really should, um fix the floor in here. I'm wondering, I'm trying to wonder what happened. It couldn't have been a creeper exploding. Because there would be a hole in the floor and some of the wall would be missing. I am missing this guy. Well, there was a guy over here. Hmm. Let's see, did anyone even know it in the book? Let's see. Oh, now these are for the custom paintings. Do I have any of them? I don't think I have any of them on me. I can show you guys that. That's something cool. The custom paintings I was doing. I'll take a ride over there. There isn't a portal that goes to it, so I don't care. For, I don't care if I ride. fall in a hole. 
GP's house. And all the sunflowers. So beautiful. <laughs> down but he did so there's the custom paint painting maker Now here's what's out there already. <laughs> Put high on it. Uh, this is a, a request. Someone requested this and I've apparently made antlers that are too small for the head. I don't think I made the antlers. Somebody else must have done it. But it's, let me see. We'll take the painting with us. Some of you might know who the character is, but I, I don't. It's a request. So someone asked me to make some guy from Bay Stars. I think that's what it's called. Like here. I'll take the... Let me just see here. I'll take that. Oh yeah, this is my offhand. <laughs> you can see it disappear and reappear on the map. I like the snow. This is the most annoying part. It's probably the snow. Pixel art. I think a couple days to make this platform up here, but I had help, so I wasn't by myself. I did it. Oh, it fell in the hole. Okay. And this, it's set up this um, map painting map maker because it's a map, is what it is. And then you put the color sound that you want. Some of the colors don't actually show up, and we found that the best thing to use is the concrete powder. So we've been stocking up on the different colors, different types of pictures. Uh, and then I've got all the supplies to make the, the dyes. And I've got this grassy oh. patch out here with one of each flower type. For colors, that is, to be able to bone meal. Now that's a that is definitely a bedrock thing. I will show you. Where's the bone meal? Here we go. Let's get some bone meal. It's definitely a bedrock thing, which I have played Java, and it's kind of sad that it's only a bedrock thing. You can bone meal the flowers, and they spread. They spread around. No. Yep. The, f the flowery bone meal spreads. Bam. More blue ones. The dye, the cocoa beans. The cactuses are green, of course. Then the big flowers. Well, those are both on Java and Bedrock are the same. When you bed, you know, you bone meal them, they drop themselves. Let's put some stuff away. And move on. Don't get in the chest. Don't need that stuff. Okay. Just taking a little adventure mm. and showing off. Onion's house is over there. That's an iron golem farm that just just does not work. Quite hideous. Mm. Don't know why he made this 
come all the way over here and onto mine because it does make a shadow onto um, the painting. But... Set up over here so that while you're making that, you can grow sugar cane to have the paper to make maps. And that's the cool thing with the... Uh, what's that new table called? The cartography table. You can put a piece of glass in and you can lock a map to stay the same way. So I, I can actually show you at my house. It's a little, uh, a little laggy here. So I showed you the, the painting downstairs of my area. That this is not painting, but map. This is my old, the way it used to look used to be a castle. It wasn't like this big house like it is now. Oh, look, and here's some of the paintings I made. The Sailor Moon one. <laughs> Fight like a girl. Narwhal. Funyun made me this one. Love her. See, you should put a little F on it. And this is where I started making banners and the failed, in my opinion, these are failed attempts. They... Some of them are okay. They're not cool, but that's where I was making them. Oh, that's two of my dogs. I should have a whole bunch of dogs, honestly. And this is my enchantment room with my Mr. Kitty. He's sitting with all these uh, creepy things like the wither rose and a conduit, which actually is a light source. Mr. Kitty! I like the way I set this up. Super cute with the vines on it. Definitely. And the skylights. I want skylight. I want all out on the skylights. And then, yeah, of course I've got... All... Oh, no. Okay. Enchanted books are still in here. For different things. Like the different... Like, see, these are all for the bow. Oh, wait. These are all for the trident. These are all for armor. These are all for, for tools. Or pickaxes, maybe specific. Yeah, weapons, like swords, lapis. And then, of course, the, that one. It's nighttime already. The days fly fast. Alright. Take a quick little nap. <coughs> and maybe we will go see what's in the mob farm. There might be some things in the mob farm making it laggy. So. This place obviously took a long time to build. I've been working on this for more than a year. Wait, that goes up. This one goes down. I've been working on this for more than a year. And, uh, anybody have armor? No armor? This is a feature I added. You flick the switch. Adds the water. Yeah, I know. It's pretty pretty basic. Oh, this is my... This is where everything gets collected. All the loot. We get all the goodies. Lots of goodies. Things. <laughs> yeah, I actually had a pillager spawn in the... Uh, the, the zombie spawning area, like I had a pillager spawn in there and he was stuck in there. <laughs> it was fun. Spare building blocks, rotten flesh, tridents, rotten flesh. There's a hole in that one. So one side's for iron, one side's for gold. 
and all my spare enchanted gold armor. Just a lot of spare enchanted things. Okay, so let's see. Oh, there they go. They turned into drown. I'll turn the water off. I'm gonna cut up with their feet. Yeah, I forgot I have all my armor on. It's a creepy basement. There must be a zombie outside. Hmm. Wonder where that zombie is. Let's see, maybe we can snipe him. flowers with silk touch and then you place them on the end stone and they grow for those of you who might not have known and I've got mushrooms over there and another wart and cocoa beans I'm trying to grow a lot of mushrooms for curing villagers and then I've got, of course, I have potatoes, carrots, pumpkins, melons, wheat, and beetroot. And then this is close to my basement, my uh, little mine. And we can take a little swim down there. <coughs> Things all right. It's kind of big. Ah, there's my bed. Hilarious. Okay. And that's from the slime. Uh, to bounce 50 blocks, the hole goes all the way up. I hear a zombie, but I don't see a zombie. Oh, I wonder if he's underneath. I'm not worried about him. But yeah, it's pretty big. Oh, the zombie's coming up after me. <laughs> Coming up. Oh, maybe he's stuck. But hopefully, I will get this far on my new realm. But you get to see some of how I build. Like, yeah, I do like things kind of, I guess, more modern, bright and girly. But I do also do all different kinds of builds, so you can't just narrow it down to one. Like that hallway there, let's see. And this one. And this goes all the way out to that uh, little retreat area I had showed you on the map as a pool and a lookout window that you can see things underwater and there's a conduit that's what that thing is there is a conduit it's pretty cool fully powered conduit <coughs> and uh, it's got it upstairs too 
I was trying to revamp this place and it wasn't coming out exactly as I had anticipated. So that's what I, I've got a new realm that we're going to start playing on. Oh, the zombie broke down one of the doors. I think that's maybe why I opened them. <coughs> that's the little fishing hut. This is like the vacation home. Take a quick swim. Whoa, drown! No! Swim into the secret hole. Why can't I fit? Why can't I fit? No! Okay. I'll go the long way. Whoa. See, I didn't put all these in here. They climbed in themselves. Let's see. Get some, some pork chops. Fishing. This is where I usually go fishing. Got the fancy fishing rod. Fish right off the dock here. And then upstairs. Got somewhat of a like, little kitchen area. I didn't go too much on decorating this. I guess that's something that maybe if I, if I come back to this world, leave me a comment if you think I should move on to something new, you know, let the old go, or should we critique some of the old stuff? That would be nice. Nice to, to have some feedback on that. Alright, let's swim back over. repeat myself <laughs> some feedback on what I should do or don't do you know be helpful this is my first video ever so honesty is the best in my opinion and uh, thank you for watching it so much thank you thank you thank you thank you thank you so so much leave a like 